Kitty and the Groovy Playdate. Pete the Kitty jumps out of bed. I cannot wait. Grumpy, Toad, and I have a groovy play date. Hey, Grumpy Toad, I'm ready to play. It's going to be an awesome day. Pete wants to play with Grumpy Toad's cool blue truck. Zoom, zoom, vroom, all around the room. But Grumpy Toad starts to whine. That truck is mine, mine, mine. Pete the Kitty says, no worries, that's okay. I'll find something else to play. Pete finds some blocks. Let's build a city, says Pete the Kitty. But Grumpy Toad starts to whine. Those blocks are mine, mine, mine. Pete the Kitty says, no worries, that's okay. I'll find something else to play. Pete sees a superhero cape. Far out. Have no fear, Super Kitty is here. But Grumpy Toad starts to whine. That cape is mine, mine, mine. Grumpy Toad has all the toys and Pete has none. This play date is just not fun. Pete is sad. Pete is blue. He thinks about what to do. Grumpy Toad, wouldn't it be better if we were playing together? Grumpy Toad says, my pile of toys has grown, but it's no fun playing alone. Grumpy Toad thinks of all the fun he and Pete have together. Yes, sharing would make this play date so much better. Grumpy Toad shares his truck with Pete. You push me and I'll push you. Zoom, zoom, room, all around the room. Grumpy Toad shares his blocks. Here are the blocks, Pete the Kitty, for you and for me to build a city. Grumpy Toad shares his cape. Okay, time for superheroes to save the day. Have no fear, Wonder Toad and Super Kitty are here. Grumpy Toad shares all his toys with Pete. They play and play and play. What a groovy, awesome day. Thank you, Grumpy Toad, for sharing your cape, your truck, and your blocks. Wow, sharing rocks. If you give a cat a cupcake. If you give a cat a cupcake, he'll ask for some sprinkles to go with it. When you give him the sprinkles, he might spill some on the floor. Cleaning up will make him hot, so you'll give him a bathing suit and take him to the beach. He'll want to go in the water and build a sandcastle too. Then he'll look for seashells. He'll find a few other things as well. He'll put them in his pail and try to pick it up, but it'll be too heavy. He'll decide he needs to work out at the gym. First, he'll warm up on the treadmill, then he'll lift a weight or two. He might even try a karate class. After the gym, he'll want to go to the park. When you get there, he'll see the rocks. He'll climb as high as he can go. At the top, he'll see the lake. He'll want you to take him rowing. He'll be the captain and you'll have to row. Then he'll notice the merry-go-round and want to go for a ride. He'll want you to go for a ride too. You'll choose the horse with the purple mane and he'll get on the whale. The whale will remind him of all the science museum. He'll ask you to take him there. First he'll find the dinosaurs. Then he'll visit the Hall of Apes. When, you, when the museum closes, you'll be the last to leave. On the way home, you'll pass by the beach. You'll help him gather all his things then he'll want to race you. When you get home, he'll empty the sand from his shoes. He might spill some on the floor. Seeing the sand on the floor will remind him of the sprinkles. He'll probably ask you for some. And chances are, if you give him some sprinkles, he'll want a cupcake to go with them. Mm -hmm.